Hey, what is up, Yappa fam? I'm excited you guys are watching this video because I want to share something with you guys today that I think is super important, and I want you guys to stay till the end so I can give you that value bomb, right? Okay, so real quick, um, as you guys know, we are doing the Firestarter, or we're launching, or we have launched the Firestarter community, which is super exciting for Yappa 238. It was literally like a, eight days ago while I was walking these same exact streets <laughs> that I... I talked about the Firestarter community, right? And um, I just didn't like tell the name of it and anything or anything like that. And it's, this is a really difficult video for me because I'm like staring at the light and you know how your eyes dilate to where like it really focuses on light. That's the only thing I reference. And then it's really, really dark. So like the dilation, it makes everything super dark. So I'm just hoping I am safe. And I'm hoping that uh, because we are kind of in this weird area. Anyway, um, we're close to the mountains and there sometimes can be cats that come. Anyway, I'm a little... Okay, that's beside the point. But um, <laughs> uh, I wanted to um, to really make one last push for the Firestarter Community f uh, Founding Member Program. Okay, um, as I was writing some, I was writing some emails for uh, those who are you know subscribed to the Apple Thirty Eight V email, and I was you know kind of letting them know like, hey, this is the last opportunity that you guys have with this. Now, before you just completely click off the video and be like, oh, this is Avil just promoting the Firestarter community, though it kind of is, I want you to hear this. And if you don't even join the Firestarter community today, I want you to uh, to kind of keep this in the back of your mind. But um, as I was typing it out, I was kind of thinking, you know, the reason why, like, wh what's the purpose of us doing this promo? What's the, what's the purpose of us, you know, um, having this founding member, like the founding members come in? Yeah, from a technical standpoint, it gets people, you know, on board and and um, you know, excited about what we're doing, and uh, you know, it, it's it's really good. But as I was thinking about it, I, I the what rolled off my tongue was I really want to give an opportunity to reward those who take advantage of opportunities in the lifetime of the opportunity. Okay, and this is a lesson I learned uh, maybe around eh, eighteen, nineteen, and I remember my dad taught it to me, and he was like, and indoctrinating my mind with this idea this concept that all like people who are successful in life when they recognize opportunity and they take advantage they, they take advantage of it super quickly um the terminology he used was speed of implementation and i remember there's a few times where he taught me this lesson um in a in a, a very very good way um, i'm super thankful for it but in a very uh corrective way because i wasn't doing that and so it's getting darker and darker the more I walk. Anyway, I just hope I'm walking on the sidewalk. Anyway, so he was, he was teaching me and he told me, he said, you know, everyone who is successful in life, whether, you know, secular or in the church, they, when they recognize an opportunity, um, they take advantage of the opportunity quickly, okay? And there was times and instances where I went back in my life after he gave me that little bit of information and I was thinking, you know, honestly, Yapa 238 would not be here if it wasn't for my dad having the uh understanding of the speed of implementation i get a word from god and i'm like dude i'm super excited why apa 238 is gonna be super cool it's a great idea and i sat on it for a few days and he turns to me he's like Ava, you just came out of prayer a few days ago you come out of prayer hopefully this person sees me i have a light on my face you come out of prayer with this thing that you said that you said not me him but you said was something given by god why haven't you taken action on it and i was like you're right, dad. And so that was me, you know, uh, that was an opportunity or excuse me, that was a time where, you know, if the speed of implementation wasn't adhered to, I would be in, like, the appetite that I wouldn't be here. My ministry wouldn't be here. So as I began to write this email, I was thinking, you know, wait a second. There are so many people in the word of God who, when opportunity presented them, presented it to, was presented to them and they recognized it, they took action. Now, again, if you don't sign up with a Firestarter community, that's not, that, that's, I mean, the purpose of this video, yeah, is to kind of talk about the Firestarter community, but the real main objective, like 80% of the objective in this video is for you guys who are going to be successful in life, whether spiritually, naturally, the whole gamut, uh, you, we have to take advantage of opportunity when it's, when it presents itself to us. Okay. Like seriously, I'm not, I'm not even joking. Uh, the first person that came to mind was Peter. And then Moses came to mind. And then Esther came to mind. And I was thinking about these characters and Peter, you know, he, he the, the, but all these characters experienced something and had a label attached to them that had never been attached to anybody in the history of what they did and, who, and, and, and what came after. Think about it. Who, like, who else walked on water? Only Peter did outside of the Lord Jesus Christ, right? 
who else, you know, had the opportunity to lead millions and millions of people into the promised land? Or excuse me, to the promised land. They didn't go in, right? But to the promised land. Only Moses did. There was only one exodus that ever happened. And Moses was the leader of it. There was only one, or not one opportunity, but there was only one other man that walked on water, and that was Peter. And then I started thinking about Esther, and I was like, you know, there was only one woman, from what I can see. No, there's there's a few. But uh, to be to have the story that she had, um, that that was could that was labeled a a a, a deliverer of Israel, right? I know Deborah was there, but you know it, you know thinking of after uh, Israel's exile and stuff like that. Uh, you know, I was thinking about man, these are pro these are like really, and what what was the commonality between them all? And the commonality between them all is that they recognized an opportunity. The bush was on fire and it wasn't charring, right? Jesus is out there walking on the water. You know, I'm I'm a queen and I, I have special access to the king. Hopefully, right? Uh, so, you know, they, there's an opportunity that presents and they took advantage of it. They moved forward quickly, right? Peter, you have one opportunity, bro. One shot before Jesus gets to the boat. There was 11 other men who cast out devils, who healed many sick. There was 11 other men with them. John and James were there as well. And the reason why I bring them up is because they were a part of the three that went on top of the mountain of transfiguration. So you have the 12 disciples. Well, excuse me, you have the 70 that followed Jesus. And you had the 12 disciples. And then from the 12, you have the three but from the three, you have the one. And that one dude, as he sees Jesus out there walking on water, he's like, Man, I could take advantage of this. There, there, there's, there, this, this may never come again. Jesus, can, can I come out? And because of his pushing and of cut, because of his seeing opportunity in him, he gets to step out and do something that I don't know if anybody else has ever done in the history of civilization. Walk on water. So kind of going back to like the purpose of this video, again, a few things, first and foremost, whether it, just in your life in general, be sure that when you see opportunity, you don't let it pass by. Okay. Like for real, like don't like just from Avial Easter, from a 23 year old young man who's been living for God for 23 years, not time Jesus ain't filled with the Holy Ghost for 18 years now. Um, purposely doing every single, uh, uh, my best every single day to live for God for a past like four, I'd say 14, 13. From, from this young dude, don't let opportunities pass you by. If there's a man of God you wanna, you wanna ask to pray for you, don't let it pass you by. You don't know what connection could be made. If there's a conference that you wanna attend and you kind of feel this weird, I should really go, don't let that opportunity pass you by. Do whatever it takes, okay, to take advantage of that opportunity. There may be, you never know what is out there to those and for those who decide to take action, right? One of the things I'm thinking of is as we teach about fasting, most definitely, you can implement prayer and fasting and it can completely change the course of your, your life, right? That's why I'm so stoked about the Firestarter community is because I know for a fact that the principles and the, the teachings that we're going to have in there are going to be life changing. I cannot see. I really cannot see. So, yeah, I could hear better from across the street. I don't want to run into anybody as whoop. But so I know we're going to talk about those things. It's going to be like absolutely amazing. But, uh, you know, so that's the main purpose of this video is when you, how would you say, when you have an opportunity you can either, and you can create opportunity too, right? But when you have, like, like Peter, he created an opportunity by asking Jesus, Jesus, can I come out with you on the water? So he asked you, he created opportunity. And then when the opportunity presented itself, right? He stepped out. And so he took action. So take action. Wherever you go, whatever you're doing, whatever you're a part of, whatever opportunity that you see in front of you, take action. Now, where it's the fire starter community is going live. It's going to be something that lives on for years and years and years. Just like yeah, but there's a lot of people who've DM'd me, who've asked me. I mean, I can like countless number of people. How do I do a social media ministry? How do I do like YouTube videos? How do I do? And I give my tips and suggestions and stuff like that. But most of the time, and I'll just be transparent. What I'm thinking in the back of my head is like, it takes a lot, and you have to really be committed to it.
not just committed because that's what you want to do and you want the social media popularity and stuff like that that doesn't amount to hill of beans really but um uh you have to be called to it because you will die out like i've seen a ton of accounts a ton of you know people just stop posting content and i've you know i've not i've put stop post content but i've never let go of yappa but um because they they're not called to do it right and so i kind of don't know where i was going with that but the fire started community oh that's what i was gonna say it's here to stay like it's not something that's gonna fizzle out in like a few months it's gonna be here i'm thinking at least for the next five years so get involved right now while the pricing is what it is and i promise you over the next man a few months once we we get it like all fully built out to where there's like six week max courses and toolkits and all that stuff is all built out. Um, it's gonna provide so much value. Value is just ridiculous. But this is the last call for the founding member promo. Um, get started, like seriously. I am like so dead serious. <laughs> Once the um, the uh, promo co closes, like tonight at 12 a.m. or 11.59 p.m. and the 59th second, right? It will be closed forever. And the pricing is going to go up to what I got in prayer. Okay. And um, just, I, I got the, I, I, like the pricing structure that I got in prayer is what we're going to be rocking with. Okay. So um, we're doing the promo. It's going to end. Get involved. You can always downgrade. You can always cancel. There's a 30 day money back guarantee. Um, and what else is there? You can cancel any time. So if like six months later, you're like, okay, I got everything I needed. You can get out. It's cool. Right. Um, and then, uh, yeah, you can get. Uh, I'm trying to think, but seriously, like get involved, okay? Um, join the community. We're going places. Trust me. The group of young apps have already joined. Who already ra raised their hand and said, "Hey, if that's you, comment down below." Who already raised their hand and said, "Yo, I'm going to invest into my walk with God." Okay, those young people. Um, we're already going to change the world, okay? Like seriously, so we are. So, join Firestarter community. Click the link down below. Go to go.yapa238.com forward slash Firestarter, all one word. And you'll be brought to a page where you can take advantage of the um, uh, fire or uh, founding member promo. Okay. Between fire and founding, it's difficult. Anyway, so you can take advantage of the founding member promo. Uh, get involved. Seriously, I'm super stoked about it. I'm super excited about it. But if you don't, if you decide not to, you're going to regret it. <laughs> you're going to regret it because the stuff that we begin to release about like how this community is growing and changing lives is going to be ridiculous. But, um, and you'll have to come out of the price, the, the, the God-given prayer meeting pricing. Um, but if you don't take anything, uh, you know, if you don't do anything with the fire starter community, just know that if there's an opportunity that present, presents itself to you, take advantage of it ASAP. Don't wait. Don't slack. Don't hesitate. Don't doubt. Take advantage of the opportunity no matter what. Okay. So with that being said, there's an opportunity for you guys to get into the fire starter community don't miss out don't miss out seriously do not okay <laughs> think of it like this I, don't, I hope i didn't swallow bug anyway think of it like this and then this is why i end this video in this video we talked about taking advantage of the opportunity when it presents itself okay i like to implement things right away i like to be like okay i, I learned that okay let me let me apply it to my life so i hope that's you so you listen to this video and if any point in this video you're like yeah you know what I should do that. Take advantage of opportunities when they present, present themselves. Okay. From there, I like to say there's an opportunity open. And now there's an opportunity on top of another opportunity. There's an opportunity for the founding member promo, stuff like that. But there's also an opportunity to apply taking advantage of an opportunity. You see what I'm saying? So that's where we're at. All the couple hundred people that have and will watch this video, that's where we're at. I just wanted to let you guys know that if you guys are really serious about taking advantage of the opportunity, take advantage of this opportunity. Okay? So that is it from Yap238. We're closing founding our promo in less than four hours. Okay? By the time you're watching this, if it's the next day, we have closed it. It is dead forever. Um, and we're going again with that Holy Ghost pricing. So, yeah, just thought I'd let you guys know. Okay, this is it. Your opportunity to take advantage of opportunity your opportunity <laughs> so do so okay guys love you see you guys on the next page i know that there's gonna be a ton of people a flood of people that go down and begin to take advantage of the opportunity so click the link in the description box below or on the top comment get involved and i'll see you guys on the other side love you Apple fam god bless see you guys bye